Hi, this is your friend Nitin Kapse. In this video, I'm going to talk about three tips to control your anger. These tips are according to my experiences and observation. So let's begin. Tip number one, take oath to manage your anger. Remind and repeat below oath until you master the art of anger management or you can create your own oath to manage anger to revise it daily. So oath goes like this. I love peace and I'll be at most patient while dealing with people. I control my anger and take pause while dealing with tricky situation and I don't lose my control. I know myself and I show at most patience when I'm not in control situation internally like less sleep, hormonal imbalance. I listen people patiently and tolerate their bad behavior and wording so I am not overreacting to them. At any cost, I don't lose my temper and shout loudly on anybody. I don't shout loudly and act aggressively even in worse condition acting against my wish or desire. Nobody is wrong or nobody is right. Everyone tries to see things from their perspective. So develop a perspective of forgiveness for any wrong and harmful act which disturbs you. I love internal peace is the most important thing. And therefore, I connect with peace giving activities and enjoy it. Tip number two, understanding your trigger points. Please take break from your daily routine and sit quietly and try to go deep inside situation when you had a extreme anger or you were out of your control. While doing this analysis, try to identify your emotions and the reasons to trigger you such an anger. While doing this, you need to take care of your own feelings and understand them properly. You need to identify like whether I was angry because somebody talked negative about my family or I had a bad day at office and I was angry at my wife or I had some hormonal imbalance and because of that I was not under my control and I was shouting or chattering continuously. So by doing this analysis, you will identify your trigger points. After identifying all these trigger points, note them down on piece of paper. By writing them on the piece of paper, you will have right signal to your subconscious mind to handle such situations in further future. So you need to understand your trigger points and your feelings to understand them properly so that in similar situation you will not be overreactive by writing them on piece of paper. Here is the last tip, tip number three, help yourself. You need to go and watch videos on anger management or you can read books on anger management. I have provided various links on a book of anger management. So by reading this books or video, collect your 25-30 tips and pick up any 5 tips which are applicable to your nature and surrounding. Every person is different and that's where solution for his anger management is also different. So check out which formula is workable for you. You can also do some trial and error while applying those tips. So by doing this practice of identifying what is workable for your anger management solution, you will finally have better control on your anger and going out of control when you are facing tricky situation. Hope these tips will help you to manage your anger and doing right things in your life. Please provide your comment. How do you manage your anger and what are your trigger points to go out of control. 
if you like my tips please comment subscribe and share my youtube channel progressive nitin thanks for listening